Um, today, what you're going to see is uh, some C-130 landings by the Connecticut, Connecticut National Guard. And uh, they're going to come in, do a couple landings, and you'll see them take off, land, and come, go do it a couple times. The real thing that you're going to see here today is an effort of collaboration for the past few years between the installation and the U.S. Air Force, um, uh, along with our reserve partners, to repair and recertify the airstrip. Uh, what has happened is uh, over the past about been about 10 years since we've done any landings out here, and in that time, the airfield kind of fell into a little bit of a disarray and disrepair. And so last summer, the uh, Army Reserves came out and they did some repairs on it. Um, at that same time, the Air Force came out, they did a survey, and they recertified the airstrip this past fall. And so now, now that the, sp the spring has come and the snow has all kind of lifted, now you can see some of the uh, things come out here. We hope to see more landings uh, like this take place. This is really, it's really a great opportunity to enhance the training of the installation um, by bringing on, bringing the Air Force out here and doing training with them. It really turns it into a joint environment. Whenever I say joint, I'm talking about between the Air Force and the Army to come together and do training and do events like this, which is what we always want. You know, it's one thing for the Army to train on its own, the Air Force to train on its own, but bringing those two organizations together to do things like this is really where we make a lot of uh, impacts and we get a lot of good training opportunities.